Kristen and welcome back to 100 baby we are here with the oh gosh uh okay <laughs> we'll lower conflict resolution so we do have Nellie here who is working on some of her manners as well as responsibility so we're having her clean up you guys how freaking adorable is she I kind of think she might be my like current favorite as much as I hate to say that <laughs> but we do have the family who just celebrated New Year's Eve and we also did have some new babies in the last episode. So we did have Queenie and Quinn. So we have a little bit of a full house for now. Okay, so Nellie has acquired. Okay, so we're gonna be able to sell those. So in today's episode, you guys, we really are gonna be focusing on the children and just kind of working towards getting their skills up just so we can um, possibly have Gracie have another baby soon. Okay, we need to make sure um, that everybody's going to school. Everybody's just kind of been working on their needs. And, oh gosh, go to school, Penelope. And, okay, everybody is gone. So we are going to make sure that we have everybody study hard at school. And, oh my gosh, I kind of like want to save this painting. <gasps> How cute is that? And look at Gracie. She even has her Strangerville outfit on. Let's randomize the pose. Oh God. Okay. So we're definitely going to need to purchase a few more of these. Oh wait. Uh, <laughs> what the freaking heck? Okay. I kind of want to save this because like what even is going on? We're going to lock this portrait. What in the world? I mean, I did just say that she was my favorite. So of course she had to kind of like take up the whole painting, but anyways, okay, let's go over. We are going to have all of the kids study hard at school today just so that we can get working on those promotions. You're gonna study hard. And of course, little P, oh my gosh. Penelope is so cute to me, you guys, as well. And okay, so we have the babies. Gracie, what are you wearing? Okay, so Erwin is not coming over. I think we're gonna have you change your outfit into something a little more. Oh, where's our, let's do this one. It's springtime, that definitely looks Fitting. So we're going to come over. We are going to be feeding the babies and working towards just kind of having Gracie work around the things around the home. Oh my gosh, who's that? Uh, how are the bees? Oh my gosh, we need to apply mite treatment. We have been neglecting these bees so bad. Let's sell our money fruit tree. So we do kind of need to kind of start having a conversation on what's going to happen when we have the new heir. So just kind of going over into Gracie. Gracie is going to be aging up in 17 days, you guys. So a little over two weeks, Gracie is going to become an elder, which means the youngest girl that we have is actually going to be taking over the challenge. So I'm kind of wondering what it is that we want to pack up and have the new heir kind of use like do we want to do bees do we want to do gardening or something different oh my god thank you we finally have a gardener that's going to help oh my gosh gracie <gasps> oh no oh my god um okay maybe we should have um put an outfit on e okay at least they're uh, irritated they're not like enraged anymore and let's lower the empathy because we're kind of like working on manners and stuff. So we're going to have Gracie come over. We are going to be chatting with the scarecrow just so the scarecrow can kind of wake up and work towards actually helping us in our garden. Because ever since we did have Gracie have a baby with Patchy, Patchy hasn't even like been helping us in the garden. So we ended up getting a new Patchy, which we need to... Um, just keep this relationship strong because I'm pretty sure in one of the last episodes, uh, oh God. Oh, we did have a small game. Okay. So Grace is just kind of working on that. And in the last episode, we did have a little bit of a party over here as well. So that one went really good for new year's and we do have the wolf spain and we do also have the plasma fruit tree. So I might end up like packing some of the garden stuff. I don't know if we will be able to take the money fruit tree oh god okay um let's go in feed the baby and find out what's wrong okay so let's go in just kind of take care of the children and what all do we have harvest um 
lids so all of those and maybe we will do a little bit of research so we do have so many arts and crafts in here oh my god <laughs> i'm really gonna miss this room i feel like when we actually have the new air move out and kind of start over like i feel like we need to have a room that is like this but i definitely need to learn from my mistakes and actually make the children's room a little bit bigger so um lots of changes to come, oh my gosh, Gracie, no, you need to come over, bottle feed. Okay, um, we need to talk to Quinn. I feel like Quinn definitely needs a little bit of conversation. Okay, let's stop research. Gracie, we have more important things to do. So, oh my gosh, you guys, I still feel like every time I look at Gracie, she still looks a little bit like a teen to me. Just because we did give her that magic drink that actually, like, sized her down a little bit. She, okay, we need to find out what's wrong. Is that what you wanted? Quinn, did you just, no, okay, God. Okay, find out what's wrong. What does Queenie want? Um, Queenie wants to have a little bit of conversation as well. Okay, so let's do, did that help? No, oh God. <laughs> let's do some super efficient baby quick hair with Queenie and, oh my gosh, I can't even talk. I'm like so excited. Let's go back over and, okay. I thought you said, let's coo at, have conversation. Oh no. Oh my gosh. I feel like this is like the hardest set of babies that we have had in a really long time, you guys. I feel like we haven't had babies that like are impossible to shush. Oh my God, we have stars. Okay, so we have Queenie who has, oh my God, yes. She has fallen asleep and she is really liking this maybe we'll rock her and oh no okay probably gonna have some bills and your bills oh wow we have seven thousand bills okay oh my gosh at least we're rich so that's fine that is insane okay so the thermostat definitely doesn't help at all are you gonna fall asleep quinn <gasps> And Gracie has stars. We have finally calmed the babies down. Gracie is definitely feeling like a million bucks, you guys. There is nothing more special than actually getting your babies to stop screaming. <laughs> okay, so Gracie is definitely feeling a little bit on top of the world. So I'm going to just kind of check out what all we have. Oh my gosh. We definitely do not need to be making any food today. Wow. Wow. Okay, so let's not really worry about that too much. So I do feel like whoever takes care of the new challenge or takes over, okay, that did not last long. Can we do, let's come in, maybe rock, make a funny face. And yeah, so I feel like one of the things that we need to have Gracie do when she becomes an elder is kind of do a little bit of like a home welcoming celebration. Like I feel like we're gonna take a whole bunch of food over and just kind of oh my gosh this crying baby i can't even focus and we haven't even been able to pay the bills um what do we have going on me a celebrity Ooh, okay and who is going to be aging up today so we are going to be aging up the babies today okay so just kind of waiting impatiently for the notification so we can age them up and I'm definitely going to be looking forward to it. So it's kind of one thing that I really dread with having twins is having just all of like the extra tears. And we're going to do a little bit of cuddling. Maybe she is hungry again. So we're going to feed her. Oh my gosh, Gracie. I feel like Gracie is kind of taken aback by these babies. <laughs> She's just kind of like, wait, I thought we had it. I thought we knew what we were doing. And what time is it? Okay, so we are going to have some of the kids start coming home in about two hours. So they're going to be able to kind of help us. And how is everybody making out? Oh my gosh. Okay, so we might actually be having some of them come home as an A student. I don't know if I'm ready for that. I don't know if I am ready, you guys, to say goodbye to Nellie and Nicole. But if the time comes, we will have to do that so that Gracie will be able to continue her family Oh my god. Okay, so she really is lo wait, oh my god. Gracie is a shining beacon of positivity for the community. Passing by other Sims will elect friendly waves and cheerful smiles as everyone's day is brightened by her presence. 
friends will be more forgiving if she commits to any social Ooh, oh my gosh okay so finally gracie has earned the credibility to host her very own charity benefit parties gather the do go go oh my gosh okay children do not receive and quinn okay hurry up we need this like birthday notification the babies have calmed down and what time is it two o'clock so we have about an hour i think we're gonna have gracie maybe we could come in offer turn off level up gracie we're singing <gasps> I mean, this actually isn't a really bad idea. I feel like Gracie is having a little bit of a hard time today. So maybe we just need to let her chill out a little bit. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, God. Um, yeah. At least nobody is home. We don't have any dogs to howl. Oh, she's just letting loose. Gracie needs this. <laughs> she honestly freaking deserves this. Sing your heart out, Gracie before everybody comes home because they're gonna be here before you know it. 2.30. All right, let's get her to do that. We can hear it thumping. <laughs> okay, so do we have the mail paid? Let's kind of get her to do that. We're gonna have to get her to stop doing her singing. I feel like in probably one of the next episodes, you guys, I think it would be a good idea to host a charity event. I feel like that would be a really good way to have Gracie maybe make some new friends and work on some current relationships as well. So I'm actually really excited that we do have that. And I need to make sure the birthday, yes, it is happening today. So we're just kind of like waiting on that to happen. I cannot wait. <laughs> I am totally ready. Okay, let's pay the bills. Let's just have Gracie come down here for that. And it's raining. And Nicole swiped another book. Oh my God. Okay, so Nicole has returned home with a school project. Completing the project will grant school progress. Okay. And we are an A student and oh my God. Oh my God. We have so many A students today. Okay. Let's first go over with Nicole. Let's bring out the cake. I think we're going to be having some birthdays today. So let's put the special cake. Every freaking time I put the cake in the dishwasher, who in the, oh my God, I'm so annoyed at myself. Okay, Gracie, you're going to have to come over and bake up a freaking cake. Dang it. I can't believe I did that. Oh my gosh. And you do not cook cakes. You bake cakes. Sims team, we need to fix this. <laughs> okay, so let's do, we're going to do a strawberry cake. We have not done that in a while. So let's do Look at all of these books. My God. Okay, so let's check it out. So we are actually going to be aging up Oliver. Wow, four birthdays. So we do have Penelope. So we need to get Penelope really working on her homework and lowers empathy, emotional control. And let's pull this. Where could we put this out of the way? Um, Let's just maybe, yeah, right here. What in the world is going on? Okay, let's put that there. And Penelope, you're gonna need to start working carefully. So um, we're gonna need to get her leveling up. Okay, I was gonna say if somebody freaking made that. Wait, where's the cake? Um, we not make, oh my gosh. Okay, let's come over and try. Let's just do a chocolate cake, I guess. And Nelly, seriously, you need to stop being so freaking dramatic. Let's have Nelly kind of come in. We can bottle feed and maybe we will even play with some of the babies a little bit. Wait, why are we so, are you in a mood? Okay, you're enraged. You really need to get over it. Even though you're so dang cute, you need to come in here and help your mother out. So we've got her in there with the toddlers. Need to keep an eye on Gracie, you guys, because this family has a really bad habit of, like, eating fresh food that is, like, meant for celebrations. We're, like, still washing the cake. That's great. <laughs> okay, so let's have any... Oh, yes. We also need to make sure that... Oh, my God. Okay, so we have good manners. How the heck did we manage that? And we have manners. Ooh, we have responsibility. Okay, so I need to make sure we put these 
birthday candles on as soon as possible. Okay, so let's put this here. So the first kid that we are going to be aging up is Nellie. So Nellie, you're going to come over and celebrate. Wait, why can we not? Oh gosh. Okay, let's move this over here and we are going to be blowing up the candles. Wow. Okay, so in the next episode, we are going to be saying goodbye to Nellie and Nicole, which I don't know if I'm ready for that. I mean, I kind of wanted them to stick around for a little bit. Okay, she is... I think you're being a little too dramatic. <laughs> okay, so we are gonna be using Siri to pick our random traits. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and four. A random number between one and four is three. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and 14. A random number between one and 14 is 14. Okay, so she is cat lover. All right, so let's have her come in and add some more birthday candles. And then we now have Nellie who is going to be coming over and blowing up these candles. Oh my gosh, that means we are going to be having two teen boys momentarily. Oh my gosh, okay. So I think I am going to have the girls actually move in in the same community. And maybe we will be able to kind of watch them grow up. So Hey Siri, pick a number between one and four. A random number between one and four is three. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and 14. A random number between one and 14 is 13. Ooh, erratic. <laughs> I mean, I can't actually picture that. So poor, oh my gosh. Okay, that works. Let's put some candles on and let's have you come over here and blow out the candles. So next we do have little Oliver coming over. Everybody's like getting so excited. Oh my gosh. So we need to get working on their homework as well. Here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't wait to see what he is going to look like. Okay. So we are going to be choosing a random trait. Oh, we need an aspiration. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Hey Siri, pick a number between 1 and 12. A random number between 1 and 12 is 9. Okay, and we'll do, oh, oh my gosh, okay. Hey Siri, pick a number between 1 and 4. A random number between 1 and 4 is 3. Hey Siri, pick a number between 1 and 14. A random number between 1 and 14 is 6. Oh my God, that is so cute because we already did have a cat lover and now we have <gasps> ooh, blue hair. Maybe we're gonna work with that and actually give him a little bit of actual blue hair. Wow, that style. Is he wearing a gladiator outfit? Okay, I mean, let's have Ollie come over and blow out these candles. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, she is like not having a good day. Wow. Okay, you're gonna come over. Oh, we need... Gracie to come over and we need to change dirty diaper. Some super efficient baby care and Ollie. Okay, so hey Siri, pick a number between 1 and 12. A random number between 1 and 12 is 9. Okay, ooh, we're getting a couple duplicates. Hey Siri, pick a number between 1 and 4. A random number between 1 and 4 is 1. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and ten. A random number between one and ten is seven. Ooh, hot headed. <laughs> okay, so you need to, oh my gosh, look at the hair. Add some birthday candles so we can put this one away. And. Where did the cake go? Please tell me it didn't go in the dishwasher. Okay, so I definitely feel like we have not had a child look like this one yet. <laughs> and we have a lot of gifts coming over. How are the babies? Babies are doing good. Cooper has sent over a gift. Okay, not you, Oliver. Look at them eyes. Oh my God, he's kind of scaring me. He's glaring. <laughs> he's like, hello, mother. All right, you guys. Well, that is where we are going to be ending today's episode of 100 Baby. 
we had four birthdays oh my god and i don't think she's actually looking forward to moving out but in the next episode we are going to be two kids less which means we will have oh oh my god um oh my god <laughs> Oh my god, why do I find this so funny? Calm down. Oh my god, I feel like this is probably a good time to have her move out. I mean, we can't really deal. Oh my god. <laughs> She's so mad. And oh my gosh, you guys, I actually had to load my game back up again because I ended the episode stupidly without remembering to actually age up Quinn and Queenie. So it is 7 30 in the evening so i'm just kind of waiting for the notification to come up so if we click over on monday you can see that it actually is their birthday so while we kind of wait for that to happen i think we will just kind of okay so they're gonna be moving out i guess we don't really need to work on getting any of their homework done but you're definitely gonna need to come over get some leftovers do your homework okay we do have a geek lesson okay <laughs> And we can move this one outside. We can get you to start working carefully. And then we do have little Ollie here to do homework. Oh my gosh, wait. Oliver has one of the projects as well. So you can also get working. We have Penelope who we really want to have her age up and um, get working better with. Oh my gosh, you need to stop. And wow. Okay, she needs to really stop working on her project reach level three you're gonna need to come in get some leftovers penelope and we probably is she gonna need a bath no but she should probably play some games or something just because her fun is actually pretty low so let's get her to come in play a little bit of games and am i hearing crying babies no <laughs> Okay, so I guess Gracie and the boys are just doing a little bit of bonding while we do have Ollie working on his homework and Gracie's just kind of waiting to host this next little celebration. And okay, so it is 8.30. We probably, after she does a little bit of gaming, we should probably send Penelope upstairs to go to bed. And I do feel like the boys should probably head off to sleep here as well. So let's get them all to go and okay maybe you guys can actually play a little bit of video gaming oh she's gone to bed okay let's get her to do that holly is like still stomping around so apparently i feel like we are not going to be getting a notification so i think we're just going to go ahead you guys and actually age up the babies so first we are going to go over to queenie and we are going to age up i'm hearing commotion <gasps> Oh my gosh, are you freaking kidding me, Holly? You came over and actually broke the dollhouse. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Okay, so Queenie has aged up, so we are gonna be choosing a random trait for her. So we have six, seven, eight. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and eight. A random number between one and eight is seven. Oh, of course. <laughs> so let's go over and we are gonna be aging up Quinn. Oh my gosh. Look at Queenie. She is so adorable. I feel like she doesn't actually even need to have a makeover. Gracie's so excited for this, you guys. We're going to have an episode with no crying babies. So like I said, Gracie is definitely going to be going over to visit Vlad to start working on... Oh, Hey, Siri, pick a number between 1 and 8. A random number between 1 and 8 is 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, Charmer. Oh my God, look at her. Oh, wait, Um. okay. <laughs> that was awkward, but oh my gosh, her hair and her dress matches and she has those cute little pink booties. Oh my gosh, Quinn, you look just like your mother. Oh, wow. Okay, you guys, well, in the next episode, we are gonna be having two spaces freed up as Nicole and Nellie are gonna be moving out, which means Gracie is gonna be able to have her next baby. So we definitely will be going over to Forgotten Hollow to visit Vlad, because I know a lot of you guys really wanna see Gracie have a baby with Vlad before she moves on into becoming an elder so if you guys have not already make sure to give today's video a very big thumbs up it always lets me know you guys did enjoy and start flooding out those comments with gracie's next baby name suggestion to possibly be featured in an upcoming episode and hopefully i'm gonna see you all next time
Bye, guys.